But right now, I want to go to an article that was in the Miami Herald from Jordan McPherson. For three veterans, Florida Panthers in particular, the journey was a long road worth waiting for. He goes on to say, forward Kyle Akposo, he has played 17 NHL seasons. And he's the brother. 1,001. <laughs> he's a brother. Do, do you say prayers for him every Sunday? Absolutely. 1,051 regular season games heading into game one of the Stanley Cup finals against the Edmonton Oilers on Saturday. Defenseman Oliver Ekman Larson, 14 seasons, 982 regular season games up to that point. And defenseman Dmitry Kulikov, 15 years, 948 games under the belt. These are guys that have put in a long career and have finally made it. When I say to the promised land, to this Stanley Cup Finals. Wait, wait, a couple of these guys made it last year. Okay, but listen to this. Akposo, he says, I didn't know if it was going to happen. It was a long time where I wasn't close to getting to this point, and I almost resigned myself to the fact that, hey, it might not happen. I've had a long career, some ups and some downs, but maybe I just had a good career and don't have a chance. Well, he has a chance this year. His team Long time waiting, trying to win their first Stanley Cup. 36-year-old Akposo knows his time to win the Cup is running out. Gone seven seasons without being in the playoffs, so he understands the task at hand. Some more from your guy Akposo. The expectations were laid out immediately. Everybody goes back to training camp. Yep, that's it. They were clear and concise, and they're no gray area. I knew what was expected, and that was phenomenal for me to hear. So Kyle, I Man, does Paul Maurice look like he, he, you know, he pussyfoots around letting you know what he you got to do? Right. Like he, he's going to be like, he doesn't tell you everything direct. If there's one guy that I love, it's because of his direct, his, um, his bluntness, his, uh, it's, it's just total honesty. It may yeah. rub you wrong, pause, but he's just being honest. He's being truthful. He's being his true self. So I think when you play for the Florida Panthers, you're going to know what your role is, what they need from you. For Kulikov, it's a very interesting path for him. He was actually a first-round pick by the Panthers in 2009. He spent the first seven seasons here in Florida. Then he bounced around to various different teams like Buffalo and Winnipeg, New Jersey, Edmondson. He says, with all the time I've been in the league, the journey that I've been on it would mean a lot to win this Stanley Cup. And Ekman Larson, a lot of hard work, a lot of ups and downs. They're all saying the same thing. It seems like it's a long career. There's been highs, there's been lows, but this can make it all worthwhile. But I think at the same time, you have to go through that to appreciate this opportunity and where you're at in life. Being in the Stanley Cup Finals, it doesn't get much better on this unreal run. So for these three guys that have been in the league a very long time, having a chance to cap off their illustrious careers with a Stanley Cup, which has truly been a magical, magical season and a magical run for these Florida Panthers. You got to feel good for those guys. You really do. Three more. Three more. One game at a time tomorrow night. It is going to be 8 o'clock, Emirate Bank Arena pregame, 7.30, right here on 560 WQAM. But, man, seven. I didn't know that. I'd forgotten that Kyle Akpozo, 17 NHL seasons. Ekman Larson, 14. Kulikov, 15. That is a long journey. And I, I mean, I don't blame, you know, uh, I don't blame Kyle Poser for saying I was kind of resigned to the fact that maybe, you know, it's just a good career. But now you got the chance. It's right there. Right there, Vlad. With all that experience, some of these guys have been there before. They're not, like I said, they're not looking around. They're not sightseeing right now. They did that last year. They admitted they kind of did that last year. This year, uh-uh. I mean, they're not sightseeing. But it, it, there was a different mindset coming in, like we said. Yeah. They had a mindset for coming in from training camp. But also, last season, I don't want to say, they were, I don't say they were middle of the pack, but they weren't. You didn't expect them to have that run that they did. After last year's run, you expect you kind of expected this Great this point, season. Vlad. Last year, we overachieved. This year... We've reached where we needed. We have a goal. We got back to the Stanley Cup final. Right. Now it's to win it. Do I think it's disappointing they lose this series? Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think this is a no. disappointing season for the Panthers at all. No. no. To me, 
greatest, win or loss. greatest season in Panthers history, no matter what. But win or lose, yeah. We still got three more. We heard from Sergey Bobrovsky after he got the game puck. He said, let's reset and do it again. That's my battling cry. That's my battle cry for the next couple of games. PK outstanding big goals, but I give it to Bobby. Yeah. 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 Yeah.